One Mattoon program is strengthening families and a school district by getting to know students at an early age. Yeah, like from the womb early. That's very early. Very early. It's the Birth to Three program. I visited Franklin Preschool for a closer look at this unique community resource. In the corner of a classroom at Franklin Preschool, seven-month-old Winnie Booker is taking in her environment. She plays with toys and picture books and makes new friends. Oh, yeah. Winnie is one of dozens of little ones taking part in Matt Toon's Birth to Three program. And Mom and Grammy both say it's been a blessing. I think it's good socialization for her. It's good for her to just go somewhere different and see new things and um, just meet new people and play with new toys. This month we are working on getting up on our um, hands and knees to promote that crawling. In 2017, Katrina Ferris brought birth to three to Mattoon Community Unit School District 2. The free program is available to prenatal mothers, as well as families within the school district who have kids under the age of three. Think of it as a support system for the youngest members of Mattoon's community. Their mission is to keep an eye on little ones' developments, as well as foster relationships with students and their families, from diapers to diplomas. What's great about Franklin Preschool, where we're at, is when a child starts birth to three, they get to graduate into preschool. We're all right here. We're still here supporting the family, and the preschool teachers continue that on. Just imagine how that child's growth and that family's growth is going to be until that child graduates. We're making differences in families and child's educational career. Part of the program includes meetings and playgroups here at the Birth to Three Lending Library. A variety of resources are available to families, from take-home backpacks to parenting books. But Birth to Three is also about prevention. <gasps> Look how long the train is. That means screening children every six months for developmental delays. Oh, where's my nose? Oftentimes, in their own homes. Can you say hi, Layla? Hi, Angelique. So going into a home, you are in that child's, literal, their life and you get to see the things that they see. Your turn. Angelique Bridges is one of the program's home visitors. Today, she's screening a two-year-old Layla for hearing, vision, social-emotional skills, motor skills, and more. Yay! She's also brought along educational materials specific to Layla's needs and shares them before chatting with mom about a few goals for Layla's development. In addition to checking in with the kids, part of Angelique's job is to see how she can help parents with their goals, too. The needs are vastly different. It could be that um, a family member wants to get their GED. They want to build a resume looking for a job. We've had some want to save for a TV, uh, save for a house. I also connect families with resources, so if they need to know where a food bank is, then we bring some information about that and help them find resources in the community uh, to help them achieve their goals. We're changing futures. Birth to Three currently has a wait list, but students are always aging out of the program. If it's a resource that could be helpful to your family, we'll connect you online at ciliving.tv after the show.